morning. So I caught the ferry from um, Crofton, just off the beach where I was camped. And now I'm headed over to Salt Spring Island. They had me park my bike down on the deck. There's not a lot of traffic. Not a lot of cars on here today, so it worked out really well. on here today. I think uh, maybe we have some weather coming in. Let me go back downstairs. See if I can do this without having my hat blow off. So I made it off the ferry and I'm headed ultimately to Fulford Harbor. 21, so that's about 12 miles. But there's little teeny tiny towns on the way. Um, I'll stop a bunch. I'm, I've got tons and tons of time. I just had to stop and get this in front of the Salt Springs Cinema. And as you can tell, based on the uh, chalkboard billboard, they're showing minions. <laughs> no, seriously, everything's very, very developed around here so far. Um, this was just kind of interesting. I had to stop and get a picture. Very crowded. <laughs> I decided to sit down for a while and um, do some people watching. This place is super crowded. <laughs> but me and my bicycle was $14 and a car with two people in it is $60. It's a 20 minute ride over here and everybody's coming here. <laughs> the island is only 12 miles long and about three miles wide. This is the little town of Ganges. It's the, probably the biggest town on the island. It's right, pretty much right in the middle, sort of a crossroads sort of area. And this is the harbor. Super hungry. So decided to stop here at this place called um, 537 Burger Bar, something like that, and brewery. Um, kind of a splurge day. Uh, about a day and a half left uh, in Canada and then I'll cross back into the United States. Somebody said something about hills. I'm pushing. <laughs> oh my god. Clearly pedaling around at 20 miles a day at sea level in the past couple of weeks has done nothing to prepare me for this little freaking 400 foot hill. <laughs> Although, I, had, I mean, to be honest, I had to push most of it. So, I put in some classic rock. <laughs> Rush, Tom Sawyer, here we go. Blackberries. I think we're going to go downhill now. This is Fulford Harbor and I think that's the ferry building or the ferry terminal right over there. The ferry that I'll take tomorrow. But tonight I'm going to go over that hill and there's a provincial park over there with the camping. So my classic rock helped out. <laughs> Listening to Kiss right now. Took, um, it's uh, 13 miles from one end of the of the island to the other on the paved roads or from the ferry to the south end 
there's a little bit more to the north. Um, 1100 mile, 1100 feet of climbing and took about two hours. So just that one little hill, that one little hill. <laughs> so I'm in Fulford Harbor, Harbor at the terminal and I came down the hill to uh, check the uh, ferry times and make sure of everything. Now I'm gonna go back up the hill <laughs> and over to uh, the provincial park. Along this little highway, many of these little roadside stands. Um, this one has egg squash, zucchini, mixed greens, and looks like the kale is empty. <laughs> but um, you just put your money in the little box and uh, enjoy. Hey, hey, made it to Ruckel Provincial Park. It was about another six miles, um, a lot of up, because we were, well, up and down, I guess, because we're ending up at the ocean on both ends. <laughs> but about another hour and about another six miles. So we came up over the hill. Um, we're like right here, I think. I'm hoping that we're gonna camp, you know, to where we can see the ocean. So I'm gonna go down and have a look. So Ruckel Provincial Park is based on an old family farm in the area. And a lot of the farm is still being operated by the family. And they give tours and such in the area. Okay, this is almost too dark for my sunglasses. <laughs> I think we'll pop out at the ocean, I hope so. So now we're off the dirt road on a dirt path. <laughs> it says to register, just occupy one of the numbered sites and the attendant will come around and collect the money. This is pretty much incredible. <laughs> Follow the path till you get down to the numbered campsites. It's a walk-in campsite, so everybody's um, borrowing wheelbarrows and having to park I don't know half a mile out and cart all their stuff in I just wheeled on into this right on the ocean just like I wanted this is Ruckles Provincial Park <clears throat> These walk-in sites are 20 bucks each, so you can load them up pretty much with eight people. Since I'm by myself, it's 20 bucks. But um, it's about six miles away from the ferry terminal. So there you have it. That was my little day exploring um, and doing a little island hopping here. This is Salt Springs Island, just off the coast of Vancouver Island. And the mainland is over there. And the United States is over there. 